What is up guys? My name's Carson, that's Sammy. We're the Complete Couple and today we're checking out the Sphere. Sphere, I'm so excited. So it's right behind us. It looks like it's got about a mile and a half line. It does look really long, like and, a really uh, long line. So basically they tell you to get here at 4.30 yep. uh, with your ticket. It's about an hour to walk around and I think the show is about an hour. So it should be 4.30 to 6.30 from yep. what I know. Uh, it was a little pricey. To How be much? honest, I don't remember. I want to say per two, it's like 375 Okay, there you go. Something like that. I can look. I don't remember. But, so it's really cool. Uh, no, you 2 is gone, so we are just going to see the Sphere show. So, we're going to see YouTube. the experience. Let's go get in line. There we go. How cool is it? I wish it was dark. It's not as impressive in the, day. <laughs> in the daylight because you see all the LED lights. So, kind of during the day, it's not as impressive because you see this kind of the screen, I guess you'd call it. It's but at night, set. it's incredible. Maybe we'll try to get some footage of the night we could plug in here. We should leave when it should be sunset. Yeah, this line looks kind of miserable. What is it, honey? A Monday. That's a month. Wow. Oh my God, there's a thousand people here. How's it going so far? We haven't moved. Don't come early, bad idea. So anyhow, so I don't know when they're gonna open the gates, but obviously not until 4.30 would be my guess. I mean, the lines, look at this. They're into the parking lot. They don't have enough uh, actual- Barriers? Barriers. Oh, they're crawling us, they're crawling us. Oh. These guys are like the almighty God. So far, it's like, like I'm going into like, the military. I think you're right. going into jail. So yeah, no big backpacks, which doesn't surprise me because a lot of shows so don't get it either. So update, it's 4.46. It's almost been an hour. We still are not, have not no made drink, it inside. No food, no bags. Leave no drinks, bag. no food, no bags. Yep. We have still not I'll made it honest, inside the I, sphere. I'll be a little, they say it's like an hour before for the robots and then an hour for the show, but I mean, we got here at 3.45. Dude, they should have let us in. I mean, even if you get here at 3.45, you're not going to have an hour We're inside. Not gonna get it. We may not even make the movie at this rate. <laughs> 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 Samuel, I have to input. I don't know about that, but listen, Samuel, you have to, Sammy's, five minutes. Listen, yeah, we have to we go. Have to check that. Sammy's gonna input a picture. I've had, I have had an Uber driver seat cushion. <laughs> Velcro to your belt. Okay, let me explain it for the viewers here. So I, here, I'll insert it right now. Uh, you know how sometimes Uber drivers has that Velcro that you sit on, you know, so you don't sit on their leather. Well, somehow Carson managed to get out of the car unknowingly with the uh, seat back it's attached to his back <laughs> the entire time. And I had it for an hour. I've been yeah. standing in line for an hour with it. <laughs> so, don't do that. We... So hopefully we make it there. I mean, there's a lot more, dude. It's gonna take a while. We're almost to the front. Five o'clock, we just hit five. Oh, hopefully we have time to show you guys the inside. Fingers crossed. But I don't know. Here we go. All right, we're in. All right, here we go, this is cool. All right, so just so you know, they uh, take away your vlog camera, so you actually have to check it. So I'm sorry for the quality. Alrighty, so there is a bar inside called the Tap House. I got a Pinot Grigio, we got some Twizzlers, there's some snacks, not a whole ton. But you do have a quick service lane, that's pretty neat. But they only have beer and seltzer, so like no wine or liquor, but that's a pretty good selection. Yeah, and some snacks. Not bad, not bad. Here we go, here's a robot. It's kind of creepy. Oh my god, look at it blink. Ooh. Whole area. Fascinating, isn't it? This level of precision offers our creators an unprecedented amount of control over the sound you will hear sitting anywhere inside the bowl. It is now time for you to make your way up the escalator to enjoy Postcard from Earth as it will begin momentarily. All right, we're in. Kind of sketchy. Here we are. <laughs> that was intense. That was seriously scary, but crazy. It's like straight up. All right, see how it is. What do you think so far? I wish I could see the robots. A little rushed, but other than that, I'm very excited. Little, def I would say way rushed. rushed. I would say way rushed. Yeah. Yep. 
I thought we would be like, oh my god, when am I going to see the show? Yes. Instead of instead of feeling like I needed oh god, I, I needed an hour more. Yeah. A yeah. Remember Earth. Wow, that's crazy. A land molded into a multitude of shapes and forms, hills of dirt and a stone. Life interconnected into communities, intermeshed into systems. It spread itself everywhere throughout the Earth's seas. But life would not be contained there. But it flourished within the rocks. Flocked amongst the clouds. It frolicked in the branches. Life scampered forth everywhere, building, feeding, making, glowing. Inventing. Hungered and thirsted, it rested and ran. It killed. The earth was a kaleidoscope of life. And everywhere there was life. Soon there was us. We paid her homage with all our arts and all our skills and all our devotion. Sought to construct a majesty worthy of the majesty around us. And because we loved her, we wished to know her. We grew. <laughs> Turned everything around us into a scaffold for our own rise. to her moans. And rather than burn our only home down around
behind us. We left of our own accord. We turned off the lights. Gave her space and time to heal while we perched on the edge of the unknown. Life returned. And as it always had before, it multiplied. Our mother and our muse returned to the garden she once had been. A garden we could visit, but briefly, and only by the few. For though we've peered into the deepest depths, we've found nowhere in this vast and varied universe that we could call a home. This place you've journeyed to, across many years and countless miles, this place you've landed now is dead. Do you remember why you are here? This planet has land and water. An atmosphere to hold it all together. It has everything but life. You may not yet remember everything. But you know enough. To do one thing. Just like in the first garden, you did not come alone. You came with someone you could live a lifetime with. Someone you could build a new world with. Someone you trust completely. You came with someone you love. You came with someone you love. So what'd you think? I thought it was really cool, actually. So the seats rumble. Yes. The air comes and uh, and shoots you in the face. They have the sense, like like Soren. Yeah, like it's just like Soren, but on a larger scale. It's trivial. So this is 16k. All right, guys. Well, there you go. All right. See you outside. All right. Horrible outro because we're on the phone. But what did you think? Postcard from Earth. The visual effects were unbelievable out of a, this world. A lot like Soren, but on like double the amount. But it's slow. It is slow. So if you're even remotely tired, you could potentially fall asleep. 100%. Which I looked around, some people were sleeping. Yeah, that's true. However, the visuals. The visuals. Were you felt like you were in the your cathedral. Seats, your I mean. seats vibrate. Mm -hmm. You get wind blown on you. It was really the castles and the cathedrals yeah, for me. Yeah, it was really good. So, overall, we're heading out of here. We'll do an outro probably on the camera. But, overall, really good, but a little bit boring. I can see that. It is slow, but the, the visual effects are there for sure. So, something to think about. And it does take forever to get in here once again. So, let's go see if we can see some robots. They're still open. Probably not. <laughs> We're just walking out, okay? It is it is just about an hour beforehand, and the line, guys, oh my god, you got people by the bus loads. This is crazy. We're just exiting. Oh my god, it's all the way over there. Wow. 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 And real quick, we didn't do a secondary outro, but overall, we really enjoyed the Sphere postcard from Earth experience. We thought the visuals were amazing. However, the only big, big downside, I would say, again, we got there very early to try to get in first so we could see all the robots. But really, by the time they let everyone in, you had only about 15 minutes, which was just 
too short in our opinion. So biggest negative is that um, I don't even know if I'd recommend getting there early because it didn't seem to help. Uh, so at the end of the day, that would be my only con. Hopefully they can get that fixed soon. But overall, Postcard from Earth was a great time. I'd recommend seeing the show. Again, I'm not really sure what to tell you about seeing the inside or the wait times, but hopefully they get that glitch fixed out here soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next Vegas video.